It's race day here at Spielberg, and the drivers are making their final preparations down on the grid before lights out. Look around, it's a spectacular setting, and I'm sure today's race will do it justice. Spielberg is a very short lap, one of the shortest we'll see in this Formula 2 championship. Seven rights and three lefts make up the ten corners of the circuit. The left-hand kink of turn two, leading into the uphill braking of turn three, represents another overtake hotspot. Here is the grid for today's race, which will be starting shortly. The Rainmaster lines up on pole position, and it's Liam Lawson alongside. Looking down the rest of the grid, we have Phipps, Armstrong, Marino Sato, and Dragovic, Awasa, Novelak, Sargent, Teo Porcher, Deruvela, Hauger, Tatiana Calderon, Richard Vashore, Williams, Caldwell, Cordiel, Jake Hughes, Dewan, Nisani, Boshon, and Enzo Fittipaldi completes the grid. And with preparations almost complete, let's head down to the track. As we await the start of another hugely anticipated Formula 2 race, I'm joined again by Davide Valsecchi. Davide, as a former GP2 champion, can we get some insight to what is running through these young drivers' heads as they sit out on the grid? Ciao, Alex. It's a pleasure to be here. They are nervy moments. There is no doubts about that. Mental strength is the key to remaining calm and focusing on the upcoming race. Formula 2 is so competitive and all of these drivers know that they are going to be pushing each other all of the way. In these sports, you have to be able to control your nerves. Okay, here we go. I know what you can do. Don't let me down. Okay, so our system checks are good. We need to stay in formation and start bringing the car up to temperature, please. Get some load into the tyres and work the brakes. We want them nice and warm by the end of this lap. Superb parking there, mate. Let's make sure we get the edge on the surrounding drivers as the lights go out. Keep an eye on the lights. The start sequence will begin as soon as the grid has formed. Be ready with a clutch.
Let's go, come on. That was a fantastic stop, faster than we were expecting. Okay, one stop to go, just one stop left in this strategy. behind is 10.4 seconds. Okay, good work, great pass.
Nice work, mate. That brings you up a place. back into the race. Perfect job on the turn in there, mate. Looks like a nice stop time. We're happy with that one. Look after these tyres now. We want to finish the race on this compound. Caution. Stop now.
Okay, final lap. Let's go. Final lap. Superb driving. That is the race win, my friend. Well done. A great win then for the ART team today. Tell me, Davide, what was the key to this success? It was down to one thing. Consistent pace over everyone else out there on the track. We could spend a great deal of time talking about race and tire strategy, what has occurred on the track, but at the end of the day, the difference here was down to simply being faster on track than everyone else. Amazing skill on show. ART, the French team who have been racing since the 90s in various forms of motorsport, are once again back on the winner's podium today after a brilliant display of driving skill. So then, it's time to see how this result affects the Drivers' Championship. The Rainmaster increases their championship lead. And so, Driver of the Day then, Davide Valsecchi, who do you think you'd go for? I have to give it to the Rainmaster. And here's how things are shaping up in the Team's Championship. ART have extended their lead over the championship. Meanwhile, Carlin moved up the table with another strong performance this weekend. After all this drama, you'll be mad not to join us for the next race. We hope to see you then. Take care.